hey y'all welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to work on my front yard bed area she is looking a hot mess okay and let me tell you i'm embarrassed to even show you guys this but yeah she needs to get worked on it's spring summer and she just needs to look right overall i did not like what the builder put in so yeah i'm about to spruce this area up and i'm going to show you what i did because yeah She's just not looking right, so stay tuned. Okay, this is what I got so far, but I did pick up some things yesterday. So, yeah, that's it. Okay, so the look I'm going for is something very minimal and clean and simple. I want a lot of perennials so but I did get some annual um, flowers which is them reddish orange ones and yeah I just want something clean and simple and the annuals I would change out throughout the season I got some white rocks and that's it okay you know how some gardens have boulders well let me tell you boulders are expensive like two three hundred dollars for a rock who wants to spend that so when I was driving, leaving Home Depot, I found this place and it was just a bunch of fallen, broken rocks. So yeah, I pulled to the side and I said, let me try to get some rocks. I just wanted like three or four rocks. Of course, I was trying to get the real large ones, but they were just too heavy. So I was just able to grab what I can. But who is spending two, three hundred dollars on a rock? Not me. <laughs> so stay tuned. Okay, so when I went back to Home Depot, this is what I picked up on the second round. Some more shrubs because it just wasn't enough. I wanted something to fill in the spots. And these are the three rocks I was able to get. Okay, I also got some black mulch. I know my last video um, last week, I got some white rocks. But I'm doing a combination of both. You'll see how it, it's going to look nice. I'm going to have to show you an inspo picture. Been working on my yard for like a week. And let me tell you, one of the shrubs, I had to dig it up. It was just looking horrible. It just wasn't looking right. I did not like the placement of it. And yeah, just look at her. She looks a hot mess. I had to get rid of it. Okay, this is what she's looking like so far. And I'm digging it. I'm digging it. And look, she's growing. the sprouts or whatever they call and uh, I don't know I think I need to trim that but I want to look online to see but they looking really nice I think and I read somewhere where when you first planting um, the hostas sometimes like one or two leaves may die like this so I'm going to remove that but besides that they look really good because they were very slouchy put my mulch back there in the back so I have five bags I just got the three so I kind of spread it out and here's my rocks kind of like place them throughout nothing too much just simple I really like this I really like this okay one more thing I forgot to show you right now I was thinking about getting a really big rock right here or I was going to put this and fill it in, fill in the space right there like that. What you think? But I don't know. I think I'm just going to put mulch. And what I'm going to do is, since this is a shrub, I think I may put this on the other side of my house. I think it will look really nice. So on the other end of my house, I think I'll just do one or get like one more and put it on the other side. So I could have some kind of greenery going on on that side on both ends of the house but I really like it okay so I was going to eventually do all rocks going all the way back but I came across a picture on Pinterest that I would insert and I really like how they had the white rocks in the front and black mulch in the back 
I just feel like it will make the space not so starky white, if that makes sense. So once you see the finish ending of this, it's going to look so nice. I really like that I didn't do all white rocks. And yeah, I think I want to do a larger rock in the front. You can't really see the smaller rock, but I changed it out. You'll see. the final reveal and I love it I really really like it it looks so good when I tell you it looks so good I am very happy that I did the combination of mulch and the rocks and yeah and seasonally so September I would change out those reddish orange ones and don't worry about my porch because I'm doing a front porch decor but I really like it. It looks really good. It looks way better than before. <laughs> Let me show you a before again so you can see. Just a hot mess. And after. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And yeah, I think um, when I remove the red flowers in September, I think I want to do all perennials. I'm not sure yet. All green perennials. But we'll see when that time comes. And I also need to add my solar lights. And yeah, and I think we're pretty much done. But I really like how it came out. All right. Talk to you guys soon.